Thanks. The plaque says it's a tiny replica of the starship Isabella in a bottle. It's a locked, bolted, and electrified gate. It's a security keypad. The battery is fully charged. It's a pizza van. Said, are you gonna use your mind control ray on us? I, uh. Out! Out! Out before you change my mind!
handsome, you, you freaking jerk! I shouldn't let you in after all the hard times you gave me. Okay, come on in. No pizza jokes, though. Sure thing, pizza face. And don't forget to take your goodie bag before leaving. We're starting the meeting now. Please, gather around. Hello all, thank you for coming to this very important informational meeting. I'm Brett Lockdown, and that's my brother Chet guarding the elevator. <laughs> Hiya. First I have to ask, any feds here? No way. All right then, let's begin. Have you heard the signals? The government is controlling your mind. They are taking away your free choice. We are becoming mindless sheep with no control over our destiny. Fight back. Are you with us? Yeah. Squawk. Yes, I'm with you. Yeah. That's all for now. Stay vigilant. And don't forget to take a goodie bag before you leave. Eek. No pinching. Ow. No pinching. Hey, no pinching! No pinching! Ouch! Ouch! Squawk! How thoughtful! What the f is this? I already f got one. It's pretty heavy. Uh, it's a brick wrapped in aluminum foil. Looks like a strange floppy disk. It says Silbury Hacker Boot Disk on the label. I can't reach that.
Cast your lot before it's too late. I think I found your mushrooms. Sweet. Hand it over and we'll see what answers the Void offers today. What did you see? Unless the killer was a rainbow dragon powered by starshine, I can't help ya. But thanks for the shrooms. Leonard and I are gonna have a blast tonight. I feel I've been had. Goodbye. Not leaving Dad's watch behind. I need to find the correct time to set it to. I need to find the correct time to set it to. I'm innocent! Can you fix this watch? If you fix the watch, I promise I'll prove your innocence. Here's my watch for you to fix. I can't concentrate over that racket. Uh, you have to change the music to my favorite. I love theremin music. <laughs> I work best when it's playing. I can't turn it off. The knob is missing and the radio's bolted to the cabinet. The sheriff left it on as a form of torch.
No way am I climbing that. I'm afraid of heights. Thanks. We interrupt our hostile takeover non-stop music with this important message. You're listening to KSCUM 198.7 on your FM dial. And now back to our special hostile... Oh, let's get the clown to climb the ladder. The circus freak will climb the ladder. Stupid ladder. Stupid ladder. For making me do this. Now I better get out of here fast. What happened? We're off the air. Just as we feared, the government sabotaged the tower. Mm. <sighs> Phew. What a climb! I'm innocent! Can you fix this watch? If you fix the watch, I promise I'll prove your innocence. Here's my watch for you to fix. Hey, you have that great theremin music playing. Okay, hand it over. Okay, your watch is fixed. Here you go. It's my father's... Ugh, what is that awful noise? The feds must be trying to brainwash me. What are you doing in my control booth? Oh, hi Cassie. Uh, we used to go to school together, right? I used to hang out in the computer lab and... Oh, looks like you're busy. Bye. How does this get here? Okay, all back to normal again. It's my father's old pocket watch. Good as new. Thank you for calling the Pillowtronics Automated Security Information Line. For today, proper start time for Station 1 is... 2 o'clock. Exactly.
Hmm, nothing happens. Looks like a tube socket. We interrupt our hostile takeover non-stop music with this important message. You're listening to KSCUM 198... It's a tube socket for Uncle Chuck's secret PF-001 Tron tube. Wait, I've seen a picture of one of these somewhere. It's a Pillowtronics t-shirt, the only thing I got from Uncle Chuck. There's a schematic of his secret PF-001 tube on the front, just like the one needed at the factory. Hi, Dolores. Oh, let's go over to the counter where we can talk. Welcome to Ricky's YouTube. How can I help you? Do you have a PF-001 tube in stock? Oh, the PF-001 is a top secret tube that only Chuck knew about. But I have never seen one in person. I don't have any in stock, but I think there was only one or two produced. But if I had the design for one, I could probably make it for you. Is the tube schematic on this t-shirt for a PF-001? Yes, it is. I might be able to build one using that schematic. Okay, here's my t-shirt. Interesting. Chuck's design is brilliant. Yes, I can make this tube. Won't be a jiffy. Here's the PF-001 tube, exactly how Chuck designed it. Thank you. It's a rare PF-001 tube. It's almost the same size as the TX-1138 tube, so my tube puller should work with it. It fits perfectly. The doors moved a little, but stopped. They must be stuck. It opened just a little more. Reset. Opened just a little more. I think they're unlocked. Mm. 
It opened a little more. Someone could squeeze through now. I think someone can squeeze through the opening now, but it's not gonna be me. No way I'm the first one through that door. Reset. Whoops. someone could squeeze through now. I think I can squeeze through the opening now. Holy... Oh, you said it, Plum. This can't be. It's not possible. What have you done, Uncle Chuck? 